Um, I can tell you that that would be probably at the direction of the speaker, but the last individual that was detained for a, basically violating co uh, Congress's authorities was actually put up at a very nice hotel. Um, I would hope that Garland would actually present himself and not make us do this. But again, you're seeing that Garland is willingly breaking the law. And that is extremely disturbing, being that he's supposed to be head of all law enforcement in this country. Any other questions? Um, as you were, uh, I stated earlier that Democrats actually apparently did try to do this. And in, upon my research, the reason why I don't believe that they wanted to is because, again, you open up uh, the hearing to discovery. And I don't believe that they wanted uh, their targets to be able to make a valid argument to the American people. You see, it's a lot easier with a two-tier justice system to have the DOJ do your dirty work and say, look, I didn't do it. But, you know, the fact is, is that the DOJ is at direction of this administration, and it is extremely alarming that we have an administration that is picking and choosing who they are going to allow to get a free pass, that there is no equal justice in this country. And that's exactly why we're all putting our names, our honor on this, is because we believe that we are in a scary time in our country and that if we allow this to continue, um, that we won't have a free and fair country. Yeah, yeah, of course. Would, I think it would be refreshing if the um, if the Democrats and the White House would choose to follow the Constitution. Okay. Can I say something? Yeah, of course. Are, are you asking us if we're concerned that the Democrat Party will politicize Congress to the point where they start doing things like impeaching sitting presidents? Is that what you're asking? Or, or, or you know, if you, you, you've had Republicans not comply with the January 6th committee subpoenas and they just down Aren't the they in jail? Yeah, they're in jail. I think they're in jail. So are you suggesting the Attorney General should be in jail? Because that's what it sounds like. Listen, what's good for the goose is good for the gander. So the Democrat Party under Nancy Pelosi politicized this body to the point where it's destructive to the fabric of our nation. And it is time for a reckoning. This has got to stop. The only way that this is going to stop is if the President of the United States reads this. This says, Joe, read this, the Congress. This is the Constitution of the United States of America. So this has to be adhered to. This is the law of the land. Is that clear? Now do your jobs, people, for Pete's sakes. Any other questions before we wrap it up? Because we've got to get to conference. Uh, thank you all for being here. Again, Garland still has time to comply with our request. Bring us the um, tapes. We want to see it. We want to hear it. And if you don't, the vote will be called up, and we will hold you in inherent contempt. The vote will come to the floor. Um, I encourage you all, though, to ask the White House what indeed they're hiding. What is Garland hi hiding? And thank you so much for covering us today. Thanks, guys. Thank you.